Hi, I'm Jennifer, and I have today's scripture readings for us. 1 John 1, 5. This is the message we heard from Jesus, and now declare to you, God is light, and there is no darkness in him at all. John 8, 12. Jesus spoke to the people once more and said, I am the light of the world. If you follow me, you won't have to walk in darkness because you will have the light that leads to life. I don't know about y'all, but when I think about Jesus being the light of the world, I think about how many times I have prayed, asking God to shed some light on a situation. When I do this, it makes me feel like I'm trading a little of my struggle for some of his strength. It's through this process that the darkness turns to light. When I search for God's light in the world, I always find it. It doesn't mean there isn't darkness, but remember what the scripture says. We have the light that leads to life. We have that light through a direct relationship with Christ, through the way Christ works through others, and through the way he works through us. Being socially distanced during Christmas sounds terrible to me. I really wish I could be with my family and friends, but I don't have to walk in that darkness because Christ came as a perfect little baby and suffered for me and for you. I feel like it's my responsibility to celebrate that by seeing and spreading light. Today, my prayer for all of us is that we never stop searching for and recognizing the light of Christ especially during this holiday season.